Hello guys, I know you are here to get an answer to the question how to crack IIT Jam 2021 examination. When you are doing your undergraduate degree in math or physics, you really will get this question into your mind. But first of all, let us know some basic things about IIT Jam 2021. You know the application of IIT Jam is usually called for in the month of September. So this year also you can expect the examination to come up in the first week, like the notification for the examination to come up in the first week of September. The exams will be usually conducted or probably conducted in the first week of February and the results will be out in March. So next we will see how is the examination pattern. So if you look at here, there are three sections, basically section A, B and C. And section A contains 30 questions, section B contains 10 questions and section C contains 20 questions. So that makes a total of 60 questions. I also given uh, the mark distribution here for the three sections you can see. Section A will give you a 50 marks, section B will contain questions of 20 marks and section C contains versions of 30 marks. So total you have 100 marks examination and you have 60 questions for that. And you should also keep in mind that you have a long 3 hour exam. So another important thing you should see here is that in section A, B and C there are three types of questions basically. That is section A contains MCQ questions of 1 mark and 2 mark each. MCQ means multiple choice questions. You will have only one answer to those questions. And second section is basically section B in which we have MSQ type questions that is multiple select questions and each question has two marks in that particular section. And if you see the third section that is NAT that is numerical answer type questions in that you have one mark and two mark questions. If you see the negative marking part you can see that is in section A for each question of one mark that you make wrong there is a, there is a deduction of minus one by three and for two mark questions which gets wrong there is a deduction of minus 2 by 3. But interestingly section B and section C do not have any negative markings. You can see the mark distribution I have given here. Section A contains 50 marks, section B contains 20 and section C contains 30 marks. So here is the first tip which I would like to give you that the order in which we must attempt the questions of IIT Jam. I think it is better to attempt the first section of IIT jam question paper because it gives you basically a, a large section of marks and uh, section C should be next and section B should be last because section B is basically MSQ questions in which you won't get any partial credits that means it could have more than one correct options and basically if you are going to suppose a problem is having three correct answers and if you are going to put only you are going to mark only two correct answers still your question goes wrong so I think the first way or best way you can attempt the questions in IIT jam examination is of this kind. The next question uh, what you must be keeping in your mind is that or what you have in your mind is that where all you can get admission. That is how many institutes are there which take admission based on IIT jam. So obviously you have around 20 IITs where you are going to get your admission. But there is no need of worry because there are another 25 or 26 institutes which are also going to give you admission based on the results of IIT jam. There are around 20 NITs, you know there are basically 30 NITs, 30 amount of NITs but 20 NITs and 5 centrally funded institutes are in fact going to give you also uh, admission for, IIT, for MSc mathematics or related area of mathematics like MSc tech all those courses which are happening in NITs. So we call this actually something like a centralized counseling for MSc or MSc tech for NITs, CCM and institutes. Obviously you have also IISC with you and all these institutes are the institutes where you can basically get admission based on your IIT, based on your IIT JAM scores. So this year I think probably this IIT JAM 2021 is going to be conducted by IIT Guwahati. Last year and the previous year it was done by IIT Kanpur and IIT Kharagpur. And we can expect the examination to be in the morning section because this year that is in IIT Jam 2020 it was actually in the afternoon section. So IIT Jam 2021 is going to be basically morning section. It basically happens like a, like in an alternate way that is if this time it is if this time it is coming in uh, the evening section the next time it is morning section and the next day it will be evening section and so on. If you come to the syllabus of mathematics you can see here I broadly try to uh, divide the subject that is the syllabus. Uh, into some few subject areas functions of 1, 2 and 3 real variables 
differential equations, vector calculus, group theory, linear algebra, and analysis, sequence and series of real numbers and integral calculus. I wanted to look at the table carefully. Here you can see there is a nice way of representation where how the mark distributions were done for these areas. And I think if you look at the cutoff of uh, the mathematics examination, you can see there is a slight change this year. So there is a sudden rise in the cutoff marks compared to the last three years. So there could be many reasons for that. It could be one small change in the kind of questions what we had, what I've shown in the previous slide, or the, the way in which they have divided the marks with slight variation. So it could be one reason why it happened. Second reason what I feel is nothing but the number of students who are writing the examination is just increasing year by year. So this year you can see there is, if you compare with 2018, you can see at least there is an increase of uh, 1,000, 1,500 students. If you're going to draw a curve using the peak points of these blocks, you certainly have a curve with positive slope. So what you can see is the number of students who are appearing for IIT jam examination every is actually increasing. The different tips I would like to give you is nothing but, the first tip is nothing but what I've already given you in the beginning, that is how you should attend the basically the sections of IIT jam 2021. Second thing which I would like to tell you is that, there are many mock tests available on IIT websites, IIT Kharagpur, IIT Kanpur websites. You can see there are mock tests available. I want you to at least attend these examinations and get you and get used to the idea of attempting online examination. How you can do it in a better and faster way. The next tip, which the next tip which I would like to tell you, and that this is a tip which I've been telling all my students also that you try to solve maximum number of problems that is you try to solve or you try to complete all the previous year IIT jam problems also what you can do here is at least for the last five years you try to take CSA or UGC net examination question papers of mathematics and try to solve different questions from that which is coming in the US syllabus that is basically if you go for B part you will be able to solve basically from that but other parts I don't know about C part whether it will be comfortable with that but you can try the part B of CSAR net UGC examination and you can try to solve maximum problems from that. One upper hand you can make is basically by trying to solve the problems of TIFR and NBHM exams also because those questions are going to be a bit more strong or a bit more interesting compared to the questions of IIT JAM. So I think friends you might have got a small idea of how is this IIT JAM examination is going to be conducted and how you can in fact crack IIT JAM 2021 by doing some good tips by following some good tips but I have given or at least some tips which will be which would be in fact helpful for you. So there is a lot of time left out for your IIT JAM 2021 examinations and I think you should really start working, start solve problems, maximum try to attend a lot of online classes that are available in internet. I have also provided some questions of the previous years in my channel. So I think you should really go working hard for that this particular examination and you should be able to crack this examination by next year itself. So thank you for watching my video and uh, please look into my channel and subscribe my channel for getting in fact a lot of problems from IIT JAM, NBHM and TFR examinations and, and best of luck for your examinations. Thank you.